Hello everybody. If you're a teacher, then you know the importance of assessing your students. And recently, Google Forms just launched a new quiz feature uh, that I think you might like. So let's say that I have the following quiz right here, uh, and I go to the settings gear. I'll go right there. There's this new tab. It says quizzes. I'm going to go right there to quizzes. And I'm going to choose to make this a quiz. Now, once I do that, it gives me some different options as far as when to release the grade. Uh, I'm going to just make sure that it's immediately after the submission. And then what students can and can't see. If you want them to see which questions they got wrong, uh, correct answers, uh, even point values. So I'll hit save. Once I do that and I design a question, you're going to notice that at the bottom of every question that you have is this thing now called the answer key. When I click on the answer key, it's going to ask me to put in the correct answer and then how many points I want it to be worth. So let's say that I want that to be two. And then I'll go to this next question right here and I'll choose right here and I will make this one worth three points. Now what I can do is I can assign my quiz like usual and I'll just do this as a preview and let's say that I have a student that takes this quiz and I'm going to respond I'm gonna hit submit now with the features that I selected students can see their responses and they can see whether they got things right or wrong you'll notice after the response has been recorded they're gonna be able to see their score so I can click right here and it's gonna tell me I got a 0 out of 2 and I got a 3 out of 3 because I got that correct. Well, something that I often see as well from teachers is that they want a limited number of responses per student and you can do that right here in the settings gear. Just like you would do in any form, it's under the general section and you would click limit to one response and that's if they're signed in to their Google Apps for Education account. Remember right here with the quizzes feature, there's uh, the ability to turn this off and there's the ability to customize this. So perhaps you have some students that you don't want to necessarily see the correct answers at this time. You can choose uh, to uncheck that. You can even not even release any of this. You can just say, you know what, I don't want to release this grade right quite yet. All right, so that's something that's really neat. Also, right here from the responses tab, you'll notice that it gives you some different insights. So the statistics look a little bit different uh, than you typically would on a Google form. I love this, that they have the average, medium, and range to help you make data-driven decisions. And it also gives you a kind of a breakdown of each question, which is great. As always with the Google Form, you have right here a spreadsheet in which you can go in. And when you go in right here, it'll give you down the score. And then also right here, uh, how many days and how many um, of my questions. Now, it doesn't necessarily give you the chart and everything in the spreadsheet like a Fluguru, But once again, all of that is built in right here into your responses tab. So check it out and uh, let me know what you think. Do you like the new quizzes feature for Google Forms.